Hey guys, welcome back to my channel, and today I'm going to be showing you my favorite kinds of breakfast foods. So I'm going to start off with guacamole. So I'm going to be saying what what you should be using for your guacamole, your avocado. So if your avocado is hard and green, that means it's not ready for you. But if your avocado is soft, that means it's ready. But if your avocado is mushy, that means it's too ready. So I'm gonna show you what the ingredients that you're gonna need. So the first ingredient that you're gonna need is avocado. And then you're gonna need cilantro. onions, red onions, tomatoes, fresh limes, one, cumin, adobo, salt, A bowl for it to put in all your guacamole stuff inside. A bowl for your trash. A spoon. And a sharp knife. So let's get started. So then I'm going to show you how to cut an avocado. So what you're going to do is you're going to take your sharp knife and you're going to just cut it inside the middle first and then you're going to need to cut it around and around until you get to where it, where it ends. So then when you get where it ends, you're just going to twist it and then if, if your avocado is um, all all um, brown, you don't want that. So let's scoop out the seed and put it inside the bowl of the trash. So then you're gonna scoop all of the avocado inside of the bowl. And let's do the other one. Make sure you don't get any of the brown spots. So then, I already have some already cut ones over here. So we can just open it and just scoop out the seed again. So I'm on my last avocado. So if you see these red looking things, that means it's from the seed. I don't want, you don't want that inside of your guacamole. So just scoop it out. Get the rest inside. You see all that red in the brown? Right there. You just want to have the last one. And it's time to scoop out the seed. Just scoop it out. You can just leave it there if you want to. There's still, um, can put all of your um, seed thing, your all the guacamole, the, all the avocados that has all the red stuff. You don't want that, and just put it in the trash because it's from the seed. And just scoop all the rest of your avocados out. You can use your hands if you would like. So now what you're gonna do is smush it. So guys, it's all smushed. And so 
I'm gonna just remind you to keep your area clean and your hands clean. So then what you're gonna need is cilantro. Just scoop it inside. You can use your hands, don't worry about that. And that's enough for your cilantro. It's a, it's a whole bunch. And just mix it, the cilantro inside. Once you're done mixing your cilantro, you want to pour in your onions. Not all of them, just a little. A little on the sides. So then you want to mix your onions in. Looking so good so far. And so now we're gonna add in some tomatoes. Not all of them, just half of them. So that should be enough tomatoes. If you don't like tomatoes in your wok, I, you don't have to put them in, but I recommend you should put tomatoes inside of your wok because they taste good inside. So now I'm gonna put some limes inside. So I'm gonna take my lime squeezer and make sure to put your lime on the way of where the holes are, this way. So then you wanna close it and you just wanna squeeze it like this. lemon and lime, but I just recommend lime. Hey guys, so now this mixture is a, a comen, adobo, and salt. And a comen, adobo is one teaspoon, but salt is a half a teaspoon. So let's go ahead and pour it in. And that's all you're gonna need. So now you're gonna mix all of it up. I hope you like this recipe that I taught you how to do. So guys, it's time for a taste test and I'm gonna show you what kind of chips that I use. These kinds of chips. And it even has guacamole on the front. So now, let's taste it. It tastes good. I'm telling you guys, you're gonna love my guacamole recipe. That's it for my guacamole recipe. Subscribe, like, and share. Bye guys!